All right, in addition to having fractal trends, we need to be cognizant of the fact that there could be counter trends inside our overall trend. What does that mean? Well, we have this hourly uptrend. This is the same example as a previous slide, one week's worth of data represented by hourly bars. Instead of focusing on the green one right here, we're gonna focus on what's happening on the two minute time frame inside our red bar here. Now, although we're in hourly uptrend overall, we're currently experiencing a two minute downtrend represented by this chart down here. So even though we're going up on the weekly, we can still have counter trends inside our overall trend that go in the opposite direction. Again, these are still fractal. They look the same no matter what direction, no matter if they're counter or sub trends, all trends look the same regardless of time frame. And what's cool is you can use these counter trends to find good trading opportunities. If you're in a strong weekly uptrend or a strong daily uptrend and you're getting short term two, five, 15 minute downtrends and you know overall that you're strong and you're moving to the upside, you can use those counter trends, find reversals, make entries, and then ride that swing back to the upside. Larger trends influence these smaller trends and identifying these smaller trends can really be a key to trading success with trends overall.